Jed here to tell you five ways you can check your go-to voicemail. This will be a quick overview, but be sure to check out our online resources if you want to learn more. Also, I've added links to more in-depth videos in the YouTube description. 1. The Desktop App You can access your voicemail by clicking the voicemail icon on the left sidebar. From here, you'll see your voicemail messages. Hover over a message for additional options. 2. The mobile app. The app functions the same for Android and iPhone users. Tap the voicemails tab. From here you can see your voicemail messages. Click on a message for additional options. 3. Dialable shortcuts, which are also known as star codes. Most business phones have a voicemail key that you can press to access your messages. However, for those that do not, you can use one of two different star codes, which are dialable shortcuts, to access your messages. The first is star 99, which can be used to check your voicemail from your business phone. I'm using the mobile app for this demonstration, but the same process works when dialing from your business phone or the GoTo desktop app. Password. Now enter your voicemail password. If you've not changed it, the default is 0000. You have one new and two old messages. Follow the menu prompts to access your voicemail messages. The second code is star 98, which allows you to check your voicemail or a shared voicemail box from someone else's phone in the office. Dial star 98. Mailbox. Now enter the desired extension number. Password. Like before, enter your voicemail password. You have three new messages. Four, email the voicemail messages to you. Go to Connect users can enable a setting to have their voicemail messages sent directly to any account they specify. I've already logged into the desktop app and this is the home page. Click the profile picture in the top right corner. Select settings. Select voicemail from the list of options on the left hand side. Click the checkbox here and then provide the email address you want the voicemail messages to be sent to. The first checkbox enables you to be notified when you receive a voicemail message, but this second box allows you to send the messages to your account. Any changes you make on this screen will be automatically saved. 5. Remote Access You'll now want to dial your extension. Some people have their own phone number and can dial that. If you only have an extension, dial your company's phone number and then dial your extension number when the auto attendant message begins to play. Thank you for calling. To continue this call in English, please press 1. To continue this call in Spanish, wait for your voicemail greeting to begin and then press the star key. The person at extension, one, one. Password. Now enter your voicemail password. Again, if you've not changed it, the default is zero, 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 zero. You have three new messages. That's all there is to check your go-to voicemail in five different ways.